traditional furniture and woodworks. I specialize in creating traditionally handcrafted custom heirloom furniture and fine furniture repair. In this 15 minute video, I will go through some of the steps and procedures I use to repair and restore this antique English oak hall chair. In the following video, you will notice that I don't use power tools. As a traditional furniture maker and artist, I only use woodworking tools and techniques that were practiced by craftsmen and artisans up until the early 1800s. Let's get started. All right, we're in the process of taking off the upholstery of the chair seat from the chair frame. As you can see, the uh, upholstery fabric itself was stapled down in many places to the chair frame rail. And underneath the upholstery fabric is uh, batting and then foam cushioning and then more uh, batting here and more cushioning and then finally the the web stretcher material. So now I've gotten most of the upholstery staples out of here um, and for the most part uh, the chair frame is cleaned up. The only thing left to really do with the chair frame is to take off the webbing on the rear uh, rail but uh, since it's not the way right now, we can go ahead and begin with the repairs to the actual woodwork. Um, and uh, just I'm going to quickly go over what has to be done here. Um, we'll uh, go ahead and, and take this apart here. And we can see that right here at this joint between the left front leg and the left side rail, joint has been broken off and it's been broken off inside of the leg so I'm going to have to take a, uh, a bit and bore those out and bore these out calling them extractions um, and then make new joints and put the joints in and re-glue them. Then we'll uh, lift this up here. Let's get this out. There we go. Here. And now you can see I've got the, uh, the front leg section out and here are the joints here. Here's the, the left front. It's got these two holes for where the dowels go. So we'll uh, clean those out and then get the new dowels in there. Uh, another thing that needs to be worked on here is we need to take the legs off of the front rail and the joints don't look damaged, but they, they are loose. Um, you can see this one, this leg in particular has quite a bit of wobble. So we'll go ahead and take that off and reset these joints. Alright, so I've got the joints cut out and I've got the new joints uh, or dowels ready to be glued into the framework. You can see uh, these are oak dowels. And 
I've cleaned up these joints in here. You can see they've been cut out. Cleaned up, ready to go. the uh, hot glue pretty much uh, the right consistency. It should run off the brush here like a thin syrup. Um, so now what we'll do is we'll start gluing in these joints. Okay. 